Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is Inside our Earth. Question number 1. Granite is an example of which kind of rock? Option A. Extrusive igneous rock. Option B. Metamorphic rock. Option C. Sedimentary rock. Option D. Intrusive igneous rock. The correct answer is Option D. Intrusive igneous rock. Granite is an igneous rock. It forms due to crystallization from magma. Question number 2. Which rocks are called primary rocks? Option A. Metamorphic rocks. Option B. Sedimentary rocks. Option C. Igneous rocks. Option D. None of them. The correct answer is Option C. Igneous rocks. As igneous rocks are formed from magma and begin the rock cycle, they are called primary rocks. Igneous rocks are created from the cooling of molten magma slash lava. All other rocks are derived from them. Question number 3. Under great heat and pressure, limestone changes into which of the following? Option A. Basalt. Option B. Slate. Option C. Marble. Option D. Clay. The correct answer is Option C. Marble. Because of extreme heat and pressure, limestone undergoes a change in its form and turns into marble. Question number 4. The Taj Mahal is made up of which kind of following rocks? Option A. Marble. Option B. Limestone. Option C. Red sandstone. Option D. Granite. The correct answer is Option A. Marble. The Taj Mahal is made of various stones. But, the primary material used is white marble. Question number 5. What is lava? Option A. Solid hot rock which is thrown away during a volcanic eruption. Option B. Molten rock which is thrown away during a volcanic eruption. Option C. Rock in semi-solid state which is thrown away during a volcanic eruption. Option D. A crater. The correct answer is. Option B. Molten rock which is thrown away during a volcanic eruption. During a volcanic eruption, magma may also pour out to the surface of the crust. Magma that has come out to the surface is called lava. Lava cools off quicker on the surface than below. Rocks resulting from cooled off lava include obsidian, lava rock, basalt or pumice. Question number 6. Which of the following rocks is an example of sedimentary rocks? Option A. Basalt. Option B. Marble. Option C. Granite. Option D. Limestone. The correct answer is Option D. Limestone. Limestone is a carbonate sedimentary rock that is often composed of the skeletal fragments of marine organisms such as coral, foraminifera, and mollusks. Its major materials are the minerals calcite and aragonite, which are different crystal forms of calcium carbonate. Question number 7. What is the radius of the earth? Option A. 6731 km. Option B. 6370 km. Option C. 6371 km. Option D. 6317 km. The correct answer is Option C. 6371 km. Question number 8. What does the word igneous means in Latin? Option A. Stone. Option B. Mineral. Option C. Rock. Option D. Fire.
The correct answer is Option D. Fire, igneous rock, derived from the Latin word igneous meaning of fire, from ignis meaning fire, forms through the cooling and solidification of magma or lava. Question number 9. Which of the following layers of the earth has the highest temperature? Option A. Crust. Option B. Outer core. Option C. Mantle. Option D. Inner core. The correct answer is Option D. Inner core. The hottest layer of the earth is its innermost layer, the inner core. Quite literally the center of the earth, the inner core is solid and can get to estimate temperatures over 9000 degrees Fahrenheit. The outer core is made of liquid and flows around the inner core. Question number 10. Which of the following processes is responsible for the transformation of rocks from one type to another type? Option A. Rock transformation. Option B. Rock cycle. Option C. Stone cycle. Option D. None of them. The correct answer is. Option B. Rock cycle. The rock cycle is a basic concept in geology that describes the time-consuming transitions through geologic time among the three main rock types, sedimentary, metamorphic, and igneous. Question number 11. Which of the following rocks is formed due to the depositional activities of wind, rivers and seas? Option A. Igneous rocks. Option B. Sedimentary rocks. Option C. Metamorphic rocks. Option D. None of them. The correct answer is. Option B. Sedimentary rocks. Sedimentary rock is one of the three main rock groups and is formed in four main ways. By the deposition of the weathered remains of other rocks by the accumulation and the consolidation of sediments by the deposition of the results of biogenic activity and by precipitation from solution. Question number 12. The core of the earth is composed of Option A. Iron and ferrous. Option B. Iron and nickel. Option C. Nickel and silica. Option D. None of them. The correct answer is Option B. Iron and nickel. This ball is surrounded by an outer core made up mostly of liquid iron nickel alloy, a highly viscous mantle layer, and, topping it off, a solid crust that forms the surface of the planet. As the Earth cools from the inside out, the molten outer core is slowly freezing. Question number 13. Grinding stones used to prepare paste slash powder of spices and grains are made of Option A. Granite Option B. Limestone Option C. Basalt Option D. Sandstone The correct answer is Option A. Granite When the molten magma cools deep inside the Earth's crust Intrusive igneous rocks are formed. Grinding stones used to prepare paste, powder of spices and grains are made of granite. Question number 14. The red fort is made up of which of the following rocks? Option A. Marble. Option B. Red sandstone. Option C. Limestone. Option D. Granite. The correct answer is Option B. Red sandstone. The entire red fort is made up of red sandstone. Named for its massive enclosing walls of red sandstone. Question number 15. The continental mass is known as Option A. Sial. Option B. Sima. Option C. Knife. Option D. None of them. The correct answer is Option A. Sial. The main mineral constituents of the continental mass are silica and alumina. It is thus called Sial, C-silica and alumina. 
Question number 16. Based on the chemical composition, into how many layers is the interior of the earth divided? Option A. 2. Option B. 3. Option C. 1. Option D. 4. The correct answer is Option B. 3. The earth is divided into three chemical layers, the core, inner core and outer core, the mantle and the crust. The core is predominantly composed of iron and nickel. Question number 17. Basalt is an example of which of the following rocks? Option A. Sedimentary rocks. Option B. Metamorphic rock. Option C. Intrusive igneous rocks. Option D. Extrusive igneous rocks. The correct answer is Option C. Intrusive igneous rocks. Basalt is a fine grained, dark colored extrusive igneous rock composed mainly of plagioclase and pyroxene. Question number 18. Fossil fuels are found in which of the following types of rocks? Option A. Metamorphic rocks. Option B. Sedimentary rocks. Option C. Igneous rocks. Option D. All of them. The correct answer is Option B. Sedimentary rocks. Fossil fuels are found in sedimentary rock, which is often located beneath a body or former body of water, such as an ocean or swamp. Fossil fuels are non renewable resources that include oil, natural gas, and coal. Question number 19. The terms, extrusive and intrusive are used in reference to underscore. Option A. Minerals. Option B. Igneous rocks. Option C. Sedimentary rocks. Option D. Metamorphic rocks. The correct answer is. Option B. Igneous rocks. Granite is the most common intrusive igneous rock. Igneous rocks make up most of the rocks on earth. Igneous rocks are called extrusive when they cool and solidify above the surface. Question number 20. There is an outer and inner underscore in the interior of the earth. Option A. Crust. Option B. Core. Option C. Mantle. Option D. All of them. The correct answer is Option B. Core. The outer core is a liquid mix of iron and nickel, but the inner core is solid metal. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonder Slate app now. Link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.